Hello, YouTube. Today, we're going to open up a, a package. And the reason why I'm in my garage right now is because whatever's in this package is for the garage. Sorry for my desk. It's a little messy right now. I've been doing a lot of work on the garage. As far as exit signs and um, emergency lighting in the garage. So right here, I have two batteries. This one I knew was going to fail at some point in time. And yes, it did fail. It was bad. I knew that. This one here stood storage for about three years and got put into service maybe two months ago and it's dead now. I don't know what caused it, but it was a faulty battery probably to begin with. And I have an exit sign there, but I installed a new one over there. And if I flip this breaker over here, it's the bottom right. If I flip that breaker, you can already see a problem. separate circuit that they see <clears throat> but there's already a problem so inside this box just like a package by uh key switches even though I didn't get it from Amazon are two Non total steel blood after batteries. Just throw all that packaging here. Yes, two. Both of these are getting put in, put in the service now. As you can see, brand new in the box. Same exact battery, actually, but. Um, this one has no label on the back. This one, yes, it does. And here's the other one. All right, so we're going to put both of these into service. I'm going to show you the inside of that sign over there. And I'm just going to go real quickly put this one up. So I would advise shutting the power off to the signs before you mount, uh, put them up or before you put the batteries in. But I'm going to leave the battery or the power connected. Actually, no, I'm going to disconnect them because of this metal rod here. Um, but let me just show you where the wire runs. So here's where the power comes in for the exit signs. And it runs there and all the way down. I would have ran it through the ceiling, but I just really wanted to get it up and these clips actually work really great to keep in the wire up on the ceiling. And it doesn't have an effect with the garage door coming up. And this one I'm gonna do a little bit better mounting it because it's starting to fall apart. And that one I saw fairly, not too long ago. And this one I installed yesterday. But there are the clips. And those are from wire shelving that you would find, like that right there, to mount that. Those type of shelvings. And they work as a really great clip for the wires. So we're going to shut the breaker off down here. And get this mounted up. Here's what these signs look like on the inside. So right here is the main power board. Here is the LED board, charger board, and what controls from emergency lighting to battery, from normal operation to battery backup. Here's where the emergency lights hook up to. This is not a high capacity unit, so you can only hook up two of these. You can remove these two and then install 
them somewhere else, but you can only hook up two of these right here. One, two. Now, they made this charger board so cheaply, it's just like the Lithonia ELM2. And yes, I'm doing this with the power on because I need the outlet over the um, by the wall and that one's connected to the same circuit as these exit signs. So if that goes out, these also go out. But it's really hooked up to the ceiling. But that GFCI over there is not hooked up to this, uh, this outlet right here, but the outlet's on the same circuit. You hear buzzing, that's what it does whenever the battery's not connected. So that's it. What I'm gonna do is install the battery, the battery's gonna go right here. Point the lights, and I will do a simulated power eyes with these things. Okay, so the batteries are all installed in this sign and this sign. What we're gonna do is flip the breaker for both signs. Come over here and turn this light off. Look at that. I can see everything in here. Now it's showing up a little bit brighter on camera, but not by much. I mean, this right here is not even lit up at all. Maybe just a little bit, but the floor is lit up like crazy. Same with this sign. Here, I get to the door very easily. And sorry, our garage is a little mess right now. But I'm pretty much done with the setup. So thank you for watching, subscribe, comment, and like the video, and have a great day.